Hey guys, this is Dr. Daniel Sugai, board certified dermatologist. I have another box here. The last time we talked about L'Oreal's gift box, I have a box here from CeraVe, and I have the three popular, or at least two of the popular OG cleansers and the brand new hydrating cream to foam cleanser, which we talked about in the other video. And this is great for removing makeup. It's good for all skin types, especially for dry to normal skin. And it has ceramides and hyaluronic acid. This one is fairly new, and uh, this is a smaller size than what you'd probably buy at the store. And it has the ceramides, which makes CeraVe, CeraVe. So we talked about this in the last video. I like this a lot. You can see up above, I'm gonna put it, how it foams up on my face. It goes from cream to foam. I want to focus today on the other cleansers. You have the foaming cleanser uh, and the hydrating cleanser. So uh, people ask, what's the difference? So if you look at the, the two here, CeraVe does a good job at saying uh, who it's meant for. So the foaming cleanser, just like my La Roche-Posay Tolarian Purifying Foaming Cleanser, I like that one a lot. It's very similar to CeraVe's Foaming Facial Cleanser because they're both good for combo normal to oily skin. It has uh, this foaming um, action, which I like to use before a shave and I actually like that foam as like a shaving cream when I don't have time to put on my Aveeno shaving gel. So this is a really nice one that I use a lot. Uh, it has, I have this on my bathroom counter and this you, I use in the morning just to remove the oils I picked up from uh, bedtime. And this has the ceramides, the three essential ceramides, niacinamide, which we all love, especially for oily skin or acne prone skin. This is an anti-inflammatory vitamin B3. That's great for that. Hyaluronic acid, which is, as you know, is a humectant that draws in water. It's a water magnet and retains water in your skin throughout the day. So great way to start the day with the foaming cleanser. Now, how is this different from my La Roche-Posay Tolarian um, foaming cleanser is that that one has its prebiotic thermal water, which is unique to La Roche-Posay. This one does not have that, but this is a little cheaper. So this is just fine. It does the job really well. If you have acne prone or acne rosacea prone skin, this one is a good one to consider. And I love niacinamide. Next, the hydrating facial cleanser. Again, smaller size, uh, but this is, this is a really nice one for, I think for all skin types really. Even if you have dry skin, go for this, this is fine. This is good for normal to dry skin, and you can compare this to La Roche-Posay's Tolarian Hydrating Cleanser. Both similar, but the other one has the prebiotic thermal water. This one does not, but this sure does the job. It has the three essential uh, ceramides and hyaluronic acid. No niacinamide though, like the foaming cleanser. So that's why I say if you have acne prone skin, this can help with acne niacinamide. So this is a really great uh, foaming cleanser that I recommend for my acne patients. For my patients who have eczema, dry skin during this winter time, this is the go-to. And if you have dry skin with acne, you can go with either one. Say you're on um, isotretinoin uh, for acne, you might wanna go for just something gentle and hydrating because you're gonna get very dry while on that medication. So is really nice. I actually use this to wash my children in the bath or the shower because this is so gentle, has no fragrance. It's good for kids with eczema or atopic dermatitis. You know, a lot of times the the soaps uh, out there, especially the fragrance soaps, can be very drying and strip the oil off of our skin. So if you have really bad body eczema, you can use this actually on your body just fine. This is very gentle and hydrating for your body. So um, that's another trick here is that you can use this in the shower. And I actually have this one in the shower, this one on my bathroom counter, uh, just to let you know. This one, this brand new one on my on my counter for possibly shaving too, and for my wife to remove her makeup at the end of the day. If you have acne, you wanna remove your makeup before going to bed. Never sleep with your uh, makeup on when going to bed because that will really worsen your acne. You're gonna occlude your pores, push more of that makeup into your pores, and start that cycle of poor occlusion, inflammation, you know, debris is gonna feed the bacteria, the C or P acnes, and it'll just get that inflammation revved up, get more inflammatory acne, or even comedonal acne. You can get whiteheads and blackheads from leaving debris on your face. So wash your face off with this. If you have heavy makeup, you might wanna do a, um, you know, an oil-based cleanser, or do that double cleanse where you do an oil-based cleanser and then the water-based cleanser. You could also just wash twice with a water-based cleanser as well. Okay, so to test out this new CeraVe cream to foam cleanser, I'm gonna put on some sunscreen. 
water resistant sunscreen SPF uh, 30 and above, but I'm gonna do the water resistant 40 and 80 minutes. So I'm gonna do a layer of 40 minutes, let it sit, and do one side, do, uh, have my 80 minutes uh, water resistant sunscreen, the Elta MD UV Active on the right side. And then I'm gonna go try and wash it off and see how it does. In conclusion, I think it did a great job in just doing one pass, one wash, taking off the sunscreen uh, very well. I had a good thick layer, as you could tell, I had a white cast going, and it took it off really well. Um, those towels, by the way, are biodegradable towels. That cleanser has definitely passed the test as I've used it over the last month. I like how my skin feels nice and soft afterwards. So uh, this is on my bathroom counter, bathroom counter. This is in the shower. I wash my face with this when I'm dry and I'm too dry to use my benzoyl peroxide at the end of the day. I'll use this to wash my face and my body too. Okay, so I hope this video was helpful. It's a really quick, just an overview on the different popular uh, cleansers out there. And I know people on TikTok have said, hey, after we talk about these, the TikTok docs talk about CeraVe products, they get sold out at Target right away. And uh, I apologize if that happens, uh, that's, um, you know, this is a very good brand I stand by. I was gifted this set when this was released. So just a heads up on that. I was not paid for this to make this video, but I have been using these cleansers already. I was just really excited to use this one finally. Okay guys, so please like the video. Please subscribe to the channel. Please share with your friends. Please be safe. I got my second COVID vaccination uh, five days ago and I felt really well. The first one, uh, I felt a little crummy but uh, for just half the day, the day after the vaccination. But the second one, the Pfizer vaccination, nothing. Just a little arm soreness, and that was it. I was able to still go to the driving range and hit the ball well. So be safe, take care, see you for the next video. Peace.